Hi guys, today just a couple of quick John McLaughlin-esque acoustic jazz guitar lines. But before we start, please remember to smash that subscribe button and smash that like button because that really helps keep the channel going and it helps with the algorithm. Okay, this first guitar line is more of an exercise than a 251, although I've based this in a 251. I'm starting on an upstroke because it works well with this pattern and rhythm. The next part is just two notes per string. And the last one being one note per string. But it's this pattern. Now we come to the next part, and really it's the same pattern. So, starting with the upstroke, so we have, and from here we go into an arpeggio, and then to another arpeggio, to two more notes, landing on the third there for C major 7. This next line starts with an upbeat and it's an upstroke that I start with, the open E string. From here I'm going to use tetrachords, four note groupings, and connect them together. So we have And from here with another four note grouping, another four note grouping, and another four note grouping. So let's connect them together. From here I'm going to use the groupings that we used in the last exercise. And to our two note groupings. And we finish on the note G for the fifth of C major 7 or C major 7 sharp 11. These were just a couple of short licks that you might find interesting, you might not, but um, they're just really exercises more than anything else and quite useful if you're into you know playing through cadences like two five ones for jazz or acoustic jazz improvisation. Anyway, if this video was of any use to you, then please smash that subscribe button because that really does keep the channel going. Smash the like button because that helps with the algorithm. Click the notification button if you like the video and write a comment if you want. And I'll see you all in the next video. And thank you for watching.